Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. I'm OP and in today's episode we'll be going over some of the best highlights from today's LPL 2024 Spring Split matchup. Without further ado, let's dive straight into the action. Bravely Knight also did reset before High Chow did, so uh -oh. having a bit of that. Oh, Bin? Speaking of coming to the lair of the Behemoth, they'll give that first blood and he gets the kill. Yeah, and ends up denying. So go fist to cuffs against Ben, and I like that a lot. Soon gonna take advantage of the moment. And take this dragon should be traded for the the long range coming in the azir next to it diego but smolders oh shun oh, finds engage high shall he just gets baited a little bit stepping forward shun is gonna get his flash that's gonna be a flash out of shun himself he gets out of tower range and survives another dive that we've seen blg execute beautifully i don't know why i didn't expect blg to pull the trigger but they did they had the tools and great on them to not only find the kill <laughs> Oh, it just sidesteps Meteor there. It's like, I'm going to get your ward. You're not getting it. Like, this thing is going to die. You want Bertle. He's up against Ben. He's entered the Behemoth Slayer once again, but he is an Udyr. He might just have another solo, and it's going to go through oh. to Ben. Enter his lair, and you better hit the head. Passive comes through with that auto, and Ben wins in the end. Crazy. Bertle looked like he was in complete control, but Ben knowing exactly what he's doing. Please, Mazel. They're going for it. It's something we highlighted from PLG every single time. Mom comes through. He's calling home once again. But I don't know how Elks talk to their parents. We'll see if that actually comes through. And now the Achu with the extra stack going in. Knight gets the kill anyways. Yeah, Knight going to pick that one up. But it looks like LG trying to make a return play on top side. No flash on Bin. Bin's going to pop the world ender. But he's got so much damage being put down on top of him. Not enough healing. And that will be a kill to Meteor. Nice being picked up. By the it worked out in LGD's favor because they actually have the six scrubs, but they also have an Udyr, and he thrives in the side lane, and you're going to have to... with is that smolder. So it will allow LGD in my mind to kind of, like, allocate resources in terms of who to target in team fights, and it'll make it a lot easier. For Elks, they'll get a little bit more uh, strength at his build usage. Rift Herald popped in mid lane. Meteor going to charge. Remember, they have the grubs, so it's going to be big. The charge completes. The tower will go down. Sun Disc at the ready, and it goes straight up. LG doing a great job so far at being able to start breaking down these structures on BLG side. Now they're going to be able to allocate a lot of resources down towards spot. You probably a game plan to get a, a good lead, but BLG are a beast in waiting, and they are waiting to come alive this game. It feels oh, like LGD they're right about to give Elk a ton of stacks. That's all I'm saying. He's he's literally about to hit 225, and it's 1940 in. He's been doing a wonderful job, but here goes Jin Zhao. He gets the engaged Donning Shadow across. Mom comes through to save the day, and it might have just done that though. Flash is starting to come out as they fight right back. The Elder has been completed mid fight, and Ben has initiated combat. The Behemoth has come out of his cave, and Knight's coming through too. We got BLG trying to head off LGD here, but they can't chase him down. Knight goes in with the spear rush, Ons over the top at the grand entrance, and BLG are starting to pick them apart one by one. As another falls, that's two down for LGD, but Knight's still chasing. Knight's still got the spear rush, and BLG don't want to give up an inch. It's so unfortunate if that charm would have landed would have been another for blg he, somehow spider sense knows they have vision in that bush so he's just going the long con here towards mid lane lgd secure their second dragon tying up the lg the lg tried to scoop in and take the turret but they didn't even get close to it and now Bertle is doing serious free damage to ben he gets scooped in and that's it they already get the catch out that's a shutdown too and lgd find everything I think it's a little bit tragic because maybe as it not being able to commit to the turret, but they're going to be willing to commit to high chow. You want to try to catch him out. Just trying to play. Oh, oh, mom's coming through. On is saved. And guess what? The execute came alive. Elk got the kill. Yeah, comes up through onto the enemy AD carry at that. So they're going to be able to push in mid a little bit more. Might even be able to get some more damage down onto this turret. Looks like On's recalling. Oh, Shun just playing mind games with Hai Chao now. Spirit Rush has been activated from Knight. But Shun just going to use his Vault Breaker back out. The turret Sun Disc will fall as well. I mean, between, you know, mm -hmm, uh, mm -hmm. let, you know, let's just get the man back in. Let's get him back. What about Zillion? You don't give any love to Zillion? 
No love to Bertle and Bin here. As <laughs> yeah. They're just going at it. Meteor is right behind Shun, but Shun makes it first. And Bin has a ton of damage with the build that he's gone. Bertle, he's going to get his flash, but he goes down anyways. Donning Shadow not going to save him. Meteor's about to go down. And Spirit Rushes are starting to just fall into Knight's pockets. All of BLT are here. And Mom's on top of it. You didn't have to add insult to injury. But BLT will injure LTD. LGD gonna regret coming in one by one and led to their downfall now. BLG pressuring multiple places on the map. They're taking bot tier two. They should be able to take this mid tier one too. Just huge fair. Gold swing. They had six people. They called they called mob. Like that's well, just what they you know, <laughs> throw under the bus. <laughs> but it does feel bad. Uh because I think those situations, right? You were on the cusp, you were very close. Now all of a sudden you're down like five thousand gold. Now you're trying to make a play on the bin, which is a good call here, but they're about to get Baron too. And Bin is gonna be taking so much of your pressure away here yeah he i mean baron comes through he goes down i think and that is elk i mean they have can ways to control space we can see with the maokai and the vision that they have Ooh, i don't know if they could be a high tail taking so much damage mom comes through he doesn't have the execute just yet but he's starting to get chunked up elk is getting pushed back though they might have gotten him but he flashes out he's trying to get show you it's show you can't get him finally does it lgd they pick apart some of them but the problem is BLD are a multi-headed Hydra, and they come straight for you. You hit the nail on the head. They might have been able to focus on the smolder, but they left so many openings for other members of BLG, and now you can expect LGD's base to get torn to shreds. LGD come away with some prizes from fighting with the snake-like He didn't get finished by Shia yet, but look at the rest of the fight. Oh my Shun God. and Knight are just cleaning house on the other members of LGD. Knight does so much nice. stacks. <laughs> you know, I I have faith that Nymera Sensei will come in clutch to uh Oh, oh, oh never mind. Oh, no, it's just clutch now. Oh, oh, People are just dead. On. <laughs> oh no! Just like that, two members gone, maybe even a third here. As uh, Knight can't get him. It's a it tragedy it. and a half, and BLG on the cusp of winning game one. Yeah, I mean, they're going to be able to push this one through, still having the bear. In there. They just go in one more time, get some more stacks, get some more kills. And BLG have shown up to the office. They've handled business. They've turned in the paperwork. And that is game number one down to them in holistic faction. It was so close for so long, but LGD didn't have enough gas in the tank. Game one to BLG. I love that BLG didn't even wait for their minions. They were like, no, we are ending right now. And it just goes to show. Advantage for getting the first one. Uh, gonna be nice. Oh no. Jin Zhao. Oh no. Jin Zhao, they're waiting for you, friend. You gotta be careful. He's flashing, but is it enough? He gets it. Shun first blood for PLG. Yeah, the support there from on. Hey. Go back to the conversation. It's just a difference on how BLG execute the game. Man. It's not, yeah, yeah, I, I, yeah. I think I spotted right on the edge. And heads up play just to see a meteor did not get spotted down here. I think Shun's gonna try to make it. So if LGD can get a kill here, it's huge. But they will need to get out as now the forces to be reckoned with are showing up. And to answer the call is Shun and Knight. A kick back. They've already gotten one. And this is catastrophe in a hand basket. A spiraling despair. It's meteor. It's enough. And Knight gets the kill. 4-0 now for B. Necessarily going to be available to them as they move forward, but they're going to try to make it so up here on the top side. As Weaver's Wall finally gets unleashed, been flashing perfectly over the wall. Here comes Enchanted Crystal Arrow. Beautiful oh. connection. And the snipe from Jin Zhao will set up the kill for Hai Chao. So it took 12 minutes, but we finally saw the kind of bread and butter of what LGD's comp does, right? Weaver's Wall, Enchanted Crystal Arrow, anyone. He gets the flash out of Shalya and the cleanse. Elk's now getting oh. TP'd on here. That is Bertle, and Elk doesn't have any way out but his flash. He's just immediately taken out. I'm a bit surprised he was even... <laughs> yeah, that was great. LGD are right on it, though. They're starting up the Rift Herald. It's already almost gone. BLG TP'ing in now. Going for it. Ult comes out from on. It's big. It's already oh, secured by Meteor, though. though. As now, Shun, he's found Jin Zhao. Maybe he goes in, he tries it, he can't get the combo off. But meanwhile, Meteor, he goes for the Crescent Guard. He's healing up, but he's gone. Ben is not Meganar, and he'll die. Bertle found one of those flanks we were talking about, but he gets kicked to his death. 
and PLG turn it around on its head. Jin Zhao just gets blasted here as the Ravenous Maul claims its soul. Soon gets another kill, and now Hai Chao, he's in a lot of trouble. Oh, Sonic Wave not going to connect there, but BLG on a rampage. Yeah, BLG. And now we're starting to see them pull ahead even more. This Rift Herald might be able to even things up in mid lane, though, because we do see Meteor get that crash in. Gonna be able to put pressure down for now. And even even looking for a potential opportunity. Ooh, oh, oh, they're oh, getting that's one over! CC. Ooh, he's just gone! He shouldn't just got off the map there, and that is that's big. the opportunity to grow even bigger. Take over this game. That'll be the cleanse burn there as well. Tower goes down. So far away. There's TP coming in pretty late. Maybe they just want to go for the fight here. A CC comes down onto Meteor. He's going to go forward with that Crescent Guard. Enchanted Crystal dodged out of by PLG, but On is already gone. Spiraling Despair comes through. The Dragon's off to the races. And now he goes right back to set up for BLG. And this might just be the best thing that can happen, right? You chunked Meteor low. LGD, though, still hoping to LCC. challenge. LCC. Shun is there. Meteor trying to heal back a little bit. He got the wind becomes lightning on the dragon, but Shaoya is the one doing the damage. Shun is there. Who's going to get the smite fight here? Shun and Meteor going at it. Here he goes for the kick on a Meteor away from oh. the dragon, but Meteor gets it anyways. Shun being a little too fancy with it. He might have just doomed his team as now Bertle is taking down multiple members. He's got Q sweet spots coming up soon, and the world seems to be coming to an end for BLG. They come forward. Shaoya's going to flash and now On gets stuck, he can't get the blast code, and more kills to LGD! LGD on oh. top wave, they have Enchanted Crystal Arrow, Shun needs to be careful. They're looking at bot side though, they actually caught him, yeah, High Chow is completely caught, that's a big shutdown, Knight almost goes down, they actually don't get High Chow, and Meteor's the one that takes down On, TP coming in, but missed time, oh. doesn't matter, because Ben's gonna flash, he's got Meganar coming up, Meteor goes a little ham here, Hai Chao still alive somehow, but Jin Zhao's almost dead now. BLG caught on the back side of the play. And then there it is, that QW from Knight not landing to be able to get the final kill. Ooh, so we ooh. have a... I just well, dead. Yes, uh, we go from one strength to a weakness there. As any That's good fair. air fault, but uh, now they're back on the map trying to get something recovering from that pick out. Luckily, there is a small window. Can't move out of it fast enough. No, and again, having to deal with not only the poke coming from Elk, but the poke coming from Knight, like Jin Zhao having to do this dance. But now we get to see what kind of dance BLG Ooh. are going to bring us. Flash from Elk, no more on that. Chains of Corruption comes through. The Whirling Death is there. Burnle, <laughs> he gets him. Smiling Despair will get him right back, though. And On is now in the fight. Meanwhile, Ben is taking the outer tower down there, but it looks like LGD actually win the fight here. They're going to take the dragon, but they've got to deal with Ben. So it's going to be a, a kind of gold trade going towards BLG for Dragon, but I don't even know if it's a gold trade because we have two kills. Can Knight Four kill them here? Ooh, the flash Another came flash. out. That was close. But oh, Bin's Shun still going. Wants it. Dude, Shun wants it here. He's not going to go for it. Bin is on to the in-hip tower and top. Meteor is going to be stopped. He will end up getting that. So that was the precipice just like Elk, but he's going to be strong nonetheless. Another pick. They got him. They got him. He has no way out of this. He has no flash, and Knight will go down. This is bread and butter again for LGD. Go to the spider mechanic and get those things figured out. You know what? LGD are actually doing an admirable job of dodging oh, no. all this poke. <laughs> Bertle! No, we said you were the man! We said he wasn't, and he gets caught! Ben just finishing off this dragon by himself, so it's going to be soul point for BLG for free and not even losing any presence or pressure for this Baron. Oh my God. It's, Elk is doing so much ridiculous damage now. Look at Bertle though. Bertle has snuck around. This is the classic. This is his moment to shine. This is what Bertle is built for, and he's gonna go for it. World Ender in. He's on to Elk, but he can't hit the Q sweet spots. He's on the Knight now, and he gets one. The Spiraling Despair is coming down, as now the Dragon to Ben. He'll be heading this way with the TP. He does not have Meganar. Meteor is caught out a little bit, but maybe it's a front to back that LGD want. They will burn down a little bit here, but they're trying to fight fist to cup versus fist to cup, and they actually get Knight out of it and onto the Baron now. Yeah, and with Bertle having that TP, they are not afraid to start this one. He still can put up an overwhelming amount of pressure. BLG have the poke of, of Elk to work with, but is that enough? 
I don't I know. No, it's not. Hai Chow getting poked out there. Seismic shove going wide. Shun looking for an interest, but Meteor just goes for the fight. Enchanted Crystal Arrow on the side here on the L2, but Meteor, he's not the focus. It's Fertile that's the focus. It should have been. They're hanging down with him as he gets kicked and brought down to the ground. Low lay the tyrants as LGD will force the hand of BLG and force the ultis, but they might have just forced their death as Ben's on to sell you, but he can't handle it. And it's time for that replay. It's BLG going straight towards the Baron. Round 15, fight! As we get into it now, Shalya's all by himself over here. They got the Enchanted Crystal Arrow out. The Baron's going down. It's the gone. BLG secure that one. Nice seismic shove from Hightow. Is it enough? They have some decent CC. Shalya can get some shutdowns. Jin Zhao gets the first one. Chains of Corruption goes a little bit wide, <laughs> but they can't follow it up because the Whirling Death is not available. Not really looking to use it in the side lanes here. More so going for a five-man in mid lane as LGD are circling back around them. Hightow pulls the trigger. I don't know if they realized all five were there, but they're trying to go for it. Elk gets enchanted by a little bit of an arrow, and there's the Crescent Guard coming out. Knight gets the Spiraling Despair on the Jin Zhao, and I think it's just dead. That's big. It is traded back. One for one so far, and LGD are hunting. It might just be two for one in favor of BLG, though. Meteor getting oh so low, but look at Shun. He had the mindset to get go for Shalya, but he doesn't end up getting the kill. Now, Elk, oh my god. Elk with a sniper. What is He's this? pulling his best Huan Fong impression what as is this? Elk gets the kill from behind. It's the Flangle for the Varus. And now Shalya, he's trying to get away, and he gets away from the first piercing arrow, but there's a mighty behemoth waiting to take you down. He does get that little stand aside there, but Ben trying to chase him down. He's just a little yordle, and he's just chasing down Shalya. So much going on. LGD just chasing Elk in a circle. He gets thrown out of the fight, gets thrown back into the fight, finding turrets off that one too. So using this Baron, Pretty well, Dragon's coming up in 20 seconds. That's what we need to look at. This would be soul for BLG. Yeah, I feel like I'm riding a Bronco right now. It's testament to LGD still being able to push one of the best in the league. And I think it's just a testament to, to where the league is a whole. We are right? trying to get here, but they're very behind the play. Bernal's just going to thrust himself forward. As Nature's Grass came across, the Whirling Death can't go through. The Baron getting low, but it's not going to go down. It does end up going to Elk, though, as BLG. Oh, my God. Elk does a lot of damage. Xiaoya just gets eviscerated. He's going down finally. Shun going to be traded back, and Bertle has done a lot of work here. As now, BLG don't have a lot of damage. Bin is going to lose his Meganar, and LGD are chasing. Knight gets caught. Knight gets taken out. LGD up the back of Bertle. Step up to the plate. Bertle just seems to have... get this tier two as well. as potentially do some serious damage to the inhib turret here. They do have four grubs, so while they might not have mites, they have a lot of turret damage. They're on it right now. Bin and on, not able to protect it. They will seed this inhib turret. Not going to be able to get more, which I think, you know. Trox. Meteor has a deep flank here, and Elk and Knight are in mid lane all by themselves. On is over next to them, but BLG don't really have much support to provide here. Enchanted Crystal Arrow goes wide. Knight is popping a little bit of damage back, and now Meteor is all by himself. This is a bit of a trouble situation for LGD. Meteor doesn't have anything to get out of this one, but he has a good health bar. Here comes the execution, though, and Ben now has a flank. Bertle trying to stop him, wasn't able to do so. Ben doesn't have Meganard, but it doesn't matter because he's got the damage from Elk who is firing away those piercing arrows. Ben making it alive. He does end up dying to Bertle. Now this is Bertle's show. They do have him in a position to do so. He can't carry, but BLG back them off. What? They might still come in. Hychow has TP. I mean, they don't really Straight. have much of an answer to try to contest it. Anytime you get that smite in there, it's just going to be in goodness. As Elk starts to aim his sights down his bow, that Elder Dragon definitely going to be something to think about for LGD. Magi's just got completed for Hychow. He's got 10 stacks still, but on to the Nexus turrets are very close to the horizon. I feel like as these inhib turrets will go down, the push continues from BLG. Oh, and now you can really start to see the amount of damage they're putting down. That's one inhibitor down. You expect it to be a second. Hell, BLG can go for all three. Yeah. Because of what I they did earlier in topside. Why not? <laughs> He's had that uh, opened up for like the entire game now, it feels like. Shaoya stepping up to get some damage in there. Does end up getting some TP coming in. LGD want to contest for a Baron that is almost already gone. Bertle is here. And we need to see people like like Ben be the ones on Bertle. Had to flash already. 
Got the Nature's Grasp out. Ben about to get Meganar, and they are in a choke point right now. Meteor and Hai need to get away from the walls. The walls have eyes, and it's called Ben. He's looking for it. He tries to get Bertle here. The wallop comes through. The Meganar into the wall. There it is. Ben setting up the fight for BLG to knock it down. And they do get the GA first. Meteor's gonna go in with that Crescent Guard, but it's not enough. Two members been picked off from LGD, and Jin Zhao just caught by a tree in the jungle as everything's coming alive around LGD to take their lives. Ben hunting him down. Xiaoya getting spiraling despaired by night gets the kill. BLG have done it. They've handled the business we set out for them to do. The Behemoth Slayer is untouched and unscathed and BLG will move on to eight and one. Let it be known, BLG will not lose with Dragon Soul and Elder, even if they will extend this by a little bit. We finally got to see them adapt. These were some of the best highlights from today's LPL 2024 Spring Split matchup. Which moment was your favorite? Let me know in the comment section below. This is OP, and I'll see you tomorrow. Take care.